Kid Friendly TV. Hey guys, it's Barbie, and today I'm going to show you how to make Girl Scout cookies using the Girl Scouts cookie oven. We are going to be baking one of my favorite Girl Scout cookies, and that is the caramel coconut. They are super yummy. I love them. Let's get started. First, you'll need to turn on the Girl Scout cookie oven. Just turn it on right here and let it preheat for about five minutes. While the cookie oven preheats, let's spray the baking pan with baking spray. Perfect. It's time to make the cookie batter. Let's pour in the cookie mix into a bowl. Mmm, that smells really good. Now I'm using the perfect cookie measurement tool and I'm grabbing five milliliters of water. Now I'm mixing the cookie batter. Don't worry if your cookie batter looks dry. That's absolutely normal. Just make sure not to add any extra water. With clean hands, I'm starting to make the cookies. Now that we have our cookie dough formed, let's make six cookies. to pat it out into a small circle. Now that we have our cookie perfectly formed, I'm going to use a straw to make the hole in the center. It's really easy. All you have to do is poke it through your cookie like that. And if you want to make it a little bigger, you can kind of work it around. Now it's time to put the cookies in the oven. Next, you pull this lever all the way to the right slowly. You'll want to bake your cookies for around seven to eight minutes. Mmm, they look good. I can see them through this window. Waiting on my cookies to bake, I'm going to cover my favorite Disney princess plate with wax paper. The cookies are done! Now I've slid this over to the internal cooling chamber for the cookies to cool off. They'll stay here for about 10 minutes. It's been about 10 minutes, so we're going to push this on over the very left. And now we're going to get the cookies out. I'm going to put my cookies in the refrigerator for five minutes and let them cool off. I wash and dried my baking pan and now we're going to melt our chocolate coating. Mmm, look at the chocolate chips. They look so yummy. To melt my chocolate, I put my chocolate chips right here into the warming station. Next, I'm going to add chocolate onto the back of each cookie. I'm going 
going to wait just a second for the chocolate on the cookies to harden up before I turn them over. And while I'm waiting on that, I'm going to return my baking pan with the chocolate up to the warming station. I'm pouring the caramel coconut topping mix into a clean bowl. It smells amazing. I'm going to add three milliliters of water. Stir this all up. Now we're putting some of the caramel coconut topping mix we just made on top of each cookie. It smells really yummy. You can also add shredded or toasted coconut to the tops of your cookies. It's really yummy. One of my secret Girl Scout tips is to add the chocolate into a Ziploc baggie. Push it all the way up to a corner and cut a small hole right here. Perfect. Now we can draw lines onto our cookies. Perfect. That looks really pretty. Since I have more chocolate, I'm going to add more stripes. I'm going to put the cookies back into the refrigerator for five minutes. Mmm, these caramel coconut cookies smell amazing! Look at them, they're so pretty! I'm going to eat one now. Mmm, this caramel coconut Girl Scout cookie is so good! Thank you so much for watching this video and please don't forget to subscribe for more daily fun toy videos. Bye! Let's see if the babies like Elmo. Hey babies! It's Elmo! Hey baby! Oh! You knocked that over baby over! Give Elmo a kiss. Mm -hmm. Oh, don't bite me.